Hi everybody, George Chamberlain here watching your dollars on this Monday morning. Hope you all had a good weekend. Here it is the, uh, the 7th already, the 7th of January, so we're moving along smartly. I'm always impressed by Apple. It's, uh, it's an amazing company that uh, provides an amazing service and amazing technology out there. Yeah, the stock's taken a beating in here the last few months, but a report out this morning just shows you the scale the scope of what this company is all about. They put out a report this morning about uh, the number of, uh, of apps uh, that have been downloaded through their, their app store, and the numbers are just knee-buckling. Remember, the app store first opened in July of 2008, so it hasn't been around all that long, okay? But during that period of time, people have downloaded 40 billion apps uh, via the, uh, again, the app store. What's amazing about that is half of those 20 billion apps were downloaded last year in 2012 in the month of December as a lot of people getting their new uh, technologies an iPhone an iPad an iTouch whatever the case may be uh, there were five billion downloads just in the month of December alone now let's take a look about what that means uh, if you go to the store you'll find that there are 775,000 apps available to choose from and uh, they have been very generous to people that have apps on there that have been approved by Apple and are for sale a lot of free ones of course but uh, some that, that do have a price tag Apple says that it has paid out over seven billion dollars to app developers I know a lot of people that have worked in the technology industry for years and have retired and all they do is sit around developing apps for uh, for the iPhones and iPads and other devices and they're getting paid handsomely for doing it so there's a, a, an amazing economy that works around this whole area so great story for the folks at Apple watching your dollars I'm George Chamberlain have a good one